My brothers and sisters, you that truly and earnestly repent of your sins and are in love and charity with your neighbor and intend to lead a new life following the commandments of God and walking from henceforth in his holy ways. With faith, take this holy sacrament to your comfort and make your humble confession to Almighty God, meekly kneeling if you're able to and sharing in the general confession. Almighty God, Father of our Lord Jesus Christ, maker of all things, judge of all men, we acknowledge and bewail our manifold sins and wickedness, which we from time to time most grievously have committed by thought, word, and deed against thy divine majesty, provoking most justly thy wrath and indignation against us. We do earnestly repent and are heartily sorry for these our misdoings. The remembrance of them is grievous unto us. Have mercy upon us, have mercy upon us, most merciful Father, for your Son, our Lord Jesus Christ's sake, forgive us all that is past, and grant that we may ever hereafter serve and please thee in the newness of life, to the honor and glory of your name, through Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. Almighty God, our Heavenly Father, who of your great mercy has promised forgiveness of sins to all them with hearty repentance, and true faith turn on to you. Have mercy upon us, pardon and deliver us from all our sins, confirm and strengthen us in all goodness, and bring us to everlasting life through Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. Almighty God, unto whom all hearts are open, all desires known, and from whom no secrets are hidden, cleanse the thoughts of our hearts by the inspiration of your Holy Spirit, that we may perfectly love you, and worthily magnify your holy name. Through Jesus Christ our Lord, amen. It is very meet, right, and our bounden duty that we should at all times and all places give thanks unto you. O Lord, Holy Father, almighty, everlasting God. Therefore, with angels and archangels, and with all the company of heaven, we laud and magnify your holy name evermore praising you and saying, Holy, 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 Lord God of hosts, heaven and earth are full of your glory. Glory be to you, O Lord Most High. Amen. We do not presume to come to this your table, O merciful Lord, trusting in our own righteousness, but in your manifold and great mercies. We're not worthy so much as to gather the crumbs under your table. But you are the same Lord whose property is always to have mercy. Grant us, therefore, gracious Lord, so to eat the flesh of your dear Son, Jesus Christ, to drink his blood, that our sinful souls and bodies may be made clean by his death and washed through his blood, and that we may ever more dwell in him and he in us. Amen, 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 and amen. Our communion has already been consecrated. Let us share. Almighty God, our Heavenly Father, of your tender mercy, to give your only Son, Jesus Christ, suffered death on the cross for our redemption, who made thereby his oblation of himself, once offered a full, perfect, and sufficient sacrifice, oblation and satisfaction for the sins of the whole world, and did institute in his holy gospel, command us to continue a perpetual memory of that his precious death until his coming again. Hear us, O merciful Father, most humbly beseech you and grant that we serve in these your creatures of bread and wine, according to your Son, our Savior Jesus Christ's holy institution, remembrance of his death and passion, may be partakers of his most blessed body and blood. On the same night that he was betrayed, he took the bread When he had given thanks, he broke it, he said, eat. It's my body of the New Testament, broken, so that you shall have life eternal. At the same time, when he had given thanks, he took the cup, he said, drink all of it. It's the blood shed for the New Testament, so that we shall all have life eternal. My brothers and sisters, I take the body of our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ broken, and I eat with joy and thanksgiving in my heart. I 
take the cup. And I drink all of it with joy and thanksgiving. Now, my brothers and sisters, take the body broken. Understand that this is the body of our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. Symbolic gesture. Take it. Eat it with joy and thanksgiving. Now take the cup, the bloodshed, the new covenant that gives you life eternal. Drink all of it with joy and thanksgiving in your heart. Let us share in the Lord's Prayer. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread. Forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, the power, and the glory forever and ever. Amen. O Lord, our Heavenly Father, we, your humble servants, desire your fatherly goodness mercifully to accept us our sacrifice of praise and thanksgiving, most only beseeching you to grant that by the merits and death of your Son, Jesus Christ, and through faith in his blood, we and your whole church may obtain remission of our sins and all other benefits of his passion. And here we offer and present unto you, O Lord, ourselves, our souls, and bodies, to be a reasonable, holy, and living sacrifice unto you, only beseeching you that all we who are partakers of this holy communion may be filled with your grace and heavenly benediction. And though we be unworthy through our manifold sins to offer unto you any sacrifice, yet we beseech you to accept us our bounden duty and service, not weighing our merits, but pardoning our offenses. Through Christ our Lord, by whom and with whom in the unity of the Holy Spirit, all honor and glory be unto you, O Father Almighty, world without end. Amen. Glory be to God on high and on earth, peace, goodwill toward men. We praise you, we bless you, we worship you, we glorify you, we give thanks to you for your great glory. O Lord God, Heavenly King, God the Father Almighty. O Lord, only begotten Son, Jesus Christ. O Lord God, Lamb of God, Son of the Father, that takes away the sins of the world, have mercy upon us. You who takes away the sins of the world, receive our prayer. You who sits at the right hand of God the Father, have mercy upon us. For you alone are holy. You alone are the Lord. You alone, O Christ, with the Holy Spirit, are most high in the glory of God the Father. Amen. My brothers and sisters, the peace of God, which passeth all understanding, keep your hearts and minds in the knowledge and love of God and of His Son, Jesus Christ our Lord, and blessing of God Almighty, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit, be among you and remain with you always and forevermore. Amen.